And Drew, in the meantime, Miss Tamara's right. next. Thanks. Yay. All right, thank you so much for shopping with us here at HSN. This hour, we are in the kitchen, and we have Michael Simon and Simon Home for you. And this is going to be a lot of fun, because if you are looking for a way to cook the way you want to cook, whether it is searing, whether it's frying, whether it's slow cooking, you can do it in the cast iron. Yes, but not your grandmother's cast iron that you've seen in the past, where it had to be seasoned, and it would rust, and it was kind of hard to clean. You are going to fall in love with the modern day cast iron. Now, this is going to be a full hour. I know we're going to see some things. You're going to see some things that you're going to want to add to your collection. And all of Simon Home is on sale now. So check hsn.com and search Simon Home. That's Simon with a Y. And you can see it all right there. And also... We always talk about uh, a great uh, benefits that you get with our HSN card. So if you don't have one yet, get one. All you have to do is um, call us or go to hsn.com to apply. And when you're approved, you can save up to $20 off of the very first purchase that you make when you use that HSN card. Now, we are joined this morning. You've seen him as a co-host um, on ABC's The Chew. He's an Iron Chef on the Food Network. He's a restaurateur. And Michael and his wife, Liz Simon, are owners of 15 restaurants, so they know food and we know, know how something. to cook. No. Yeah. I had a full head of curly hair before that whole restaurant thing started. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, you know what? We benefit. Oh, we yes. benefit from yeah. all of that. It's so, fun, though. For sure. So we're going to be together this whole hour, <laughs> and we're also simulcasting live on HSN's Facebook page. So if you have any questions about the cookware or anything in this hour, please ask here, and we'll answer it live. So we're going to get it started because when I was talk when I started off, I was talking about cast iron. And for many of us, we think about the old school cast iron. This is going to be different. We're starting off with your three and, uh, and three quarters quart of the cast iron aluminum casserole with the lid. So literally, you can cook in the base. And if you want to flip it over and cook in the lid, you have a grill. Yeah, this is so cool. This is probably the... I, the mine and Liz's favorite pan that we've created because it's so versatile. Liz is over here working on a stuffing. I have a ham steak going. And the cool thing that you could see is it looks like one pan when you look at it, but the lid doubles as a grill pan. So not only is it a lid that, and you can go in and out of the oven with all these, but you got a grill pan too. Yes, this is so great. Now, you're choosing uh, whether you want it in blue, which is the one you were just seeing. You see it right there on the stove in burgundy. And it also comes in taupe. And I think these are beautiful, sophisticated colors to add to your kitchen and to add to your cooking. And a great. lot different than the, than just the basic black cast iron. We oh, used to see. for right. sure. Right, absolutely. Yes. What do you no, got no, going, that, Lizzie? Well, I'm, you know, the holidays are coming. They're right upon us. And so I'm just going to do sort of a little bit of a classic sausage stuffing. Okay. Um, which this pan is just perfect for because not only do you prepare everything in this one pan, mm -hmm. so you're not, you know, wasting and having all these dishes to wash, but then you can just serve it right in this. I mean, it looks gorgeous. Well, I, we'll see it completely yes. finished a little bit in a little bit. Yeah. Um, but it's it, it's just, it's a beautiful thing. It is. And, you know, there's something about with, you know, cooking here, having all of, you know, the dish served right there, it retains the heat. Exactly. So your food is going to stay at the temperature you well, want. Well, that's the thing. I mean, once this comes off the table, we've got, you know, I usually just put it on a trivet, mm -hmm. which also retains heat. So that's going to keep it a ah. little bit warm as well. Okay. And um, this is going to stay hot in this pan for a good it's hour, close I would to an say. Hour. Wow. You know, even if you tent it with some foil or something yeah, like that. Yeah, it really, really holds its heat. The great thing, though, when you're cooking on it, too, not only after you serve it does it hold its heat, but when most pans, if you get, like, a thin, flimsy pan, no matter how hot you get it on the stove, it doesn't conduct heat good. Mm -hmm. So when you put something that's not hot onto it, the whole pan goes out in temperature. You never get caramelization. Yeah. Like, look, this is what I want to show you here. I, just, I put the ham stick on right when we started talking. Okay. Just a little bit of olive oil. I brushed some mustard on the back side. And you could see... Oh, wow. Look at the caramelization you know and Beauty. I'm over like a medium heat right here yeah. and the pan just throws so much heat and that's where the flavor is all that char yeah. that's where really chefs that's the secret that's the secret sauce that's where you get the flavor well okay. I was gonna say too even with this stuffing because I'm starting this on the stovetop and then going 
into the oven. Yeah. You know, sometimes you get those darker spots, you know, like if you have a pan that doesn't conduct the heat as well. Yeah. You know, you can get uneven cooking, you know, so this is going to be all nice and uniform once it's completely finished, and, and which is great. Big, and that's a big deal too. When you're cooking particularly, I love that you're showing ham, you're showing stuffing, because I start to think about cooking for the, for the family. Oh yeah. Absolutely. And when you're cooking, let's say your Thanksgiving meal, that some people cook for days. You know, you're right. prepping, you're, you're, you spend a couple of hours at the grocery store. You want to be able to count on your cookware. You want your food to come out right. Exactly. And so this, true. you know, gives you that peace of mind. And right. you know, when, when yeah. you cook like that too, you don't want to have to overthink things. Like there's nothing worse than you put a pan down on the stove and one part of the pan's hot, one part of right. the pan's cold. Nothing is even. This way everything is cooking evenly. Mm -hmm. It makes your job easier. And one of the things that Lizzie and I haven't even talked about yet is the other thing I hate as a chef mm -hmm. is when I'm going into the pan, I don't one half to worry, do I need a wooden spoon, a plastic spoon, or this spoon, right. or that spoon. Mm -hmm. With these, because they release so beautifully and kind of react a little bit like a nonstick in that manner, yeah. but you don't have to worry about, oh, you could only use this magic spoon right. to work in this yeah. pan. You yeah. could use any kind of tool and the pan could take wow. it. Not only that, but any Good. type of cooktop that you have is also um, going to work beautifully with these pans. They, it works on every single stovetop surface. That's true and so no matter how you cook where you cook what you like to cook with what you like to cook in terms of the food you're doing it so easily and we wanted to start off with this customer pick because this might be a pan that you don't have yet this is and we do have a set for you so if you're saying i i kind of need to replace everything in my kitchen we've got a really great seven piece set for you coming up we also have if you just need a fry pan we've got that coming up as well but I think this is really great for whether you're cooking for a family of one or two or whether you're cooking for a house full of people because you can use the base and the lid. It, yeah, it's right. so universal. Mm -hmm. And you know, you could do so much in the 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 base right here, I mean, I made a pie in it the other day for all our friends came over. We fed eight people out of one pan. Right. Oh but God. there's yeah. times where, you know, you could do well, something for two or three out well, of the two. And you so. also did, on the, on the lid, you did the grilled bread. Oh, I did the grilled bread, right. You know, to go with it, which was spectacular. And you know, it's one. So you're really, you're getting the two, two pans for the price of one. For really. sure. That's exactly what it is. And, um, and I love that we are starting off with this. We do have a holiday price. So we're getting you ready for the holidays. Right. <laughs> you even have flex pay to get this home and you've got four flex of $14.99. Your only choice is whether to get it in blue, if right. you want it in burgundy, or if you want it in taupe. I think exactly. we're paying for shipping too, right? That's, let's, yes. yeah, and I it's free shipping. See? And Which that's is a big deal that, because these, they're, heavy, they're, yeah. they're not light. You yeah. know? That cast they're iron cast that iron. Yeah. You know, so it's a nice, sturdy pan. I'm glad you mentioned that because my mom has a cast iron fry pan that she's had for over 40 years. Right. I know that. Um, I don't know what the original color of it was. <laughs> <laughs> but it's got one long handle, and I tell you, when it's filled, it's heavy. It is. You and did two handles. Yeah, I mean, we will, this, these are about 10% lighter than those classic ones, you know. Okay. But we wanted to really make sure that they're easy to get in and out of it. So two big double loop handles, mm -hmm. so you could get in there and pick them up. And it, it makes them very manageable. For sure. Yeah. I, I also love if you have multiple you know, things on the stove, you don't have handles bumping into each other. Right. That is a really good point. That is. I, I never even like thought of that, I but it's a great that, point. <laughs> but I what, did not. Liz, yeah. what, what do you, that, I want that Well, this that is, right a, a, again, the holidays, this is um, almost a classic green bean casserole without the canned soup. But, I mean, you can see this is not off the heat. This is just from the oven. Mm -hmm. it's and bubbling. it's still bubbling. Yeah. I mean, it really holds the heat. And that's sure. that's really what you want to see. And you guys look into this one here though. I mean, I'm making a pasta now. Butternut squash, oh. shiitake mushrooms, oh a little bit of fresh thyme and garlic, and, so and in a brown butter sauce. Oh. So again, because everything heats so evenly, yeah. you can see that the butter is browning very uniformly. So it's not burning in one place. And here's what I talk about when I say, it's not nonstick, but it releases great. So when you caramelize in a pan, when we're at the restaurants and we caramelize in pans, we want all that nutty goodness that really happens on the bottom pan that you can't get on the bottom of a non 
nonstick mm -hmm. because that is what I'm gonna pull up into my sauce. Okay. So when I put the garlic in here, Ooh. and then I take some of this roasted butternut squash Jeez. and put it in there. Oh my God. And I, I'm gonna, yeah. I'm, it's, it's late, it's oh. 2 a.m., we gotta stay awake. <laughs> We're gonna put a little bit of chili flake okay, in there just to it. keep let's, it going. What's next? Flat leaf <laughs> parsley. We need some wine in here. Fresh yes. thyme. <laughs> We could do. Well, you want wine? I don't want wine. Like, it's two a.m. Let's do this wine. This is how you should cook. So, <laughs> so look. All that we chefs call it the fond, and all it means is those little beautiful brown bits that form at the bottom of the pan. When I put some of Lizzie's white wine in here <laughs> to deglaze, you'll hear I chefs mean, say deglaze. Yeah, now, if Liz that. rubs it with the wooden spoon. Yeah. Now look at when if you get a shot of that as she's rubbing look down. Look, that. there's, I mean, there's not, nothing. There's on nothing. There. Not right. even a nugget has yeah. stuck to the bottom. Yeah. It's yeah. all up into our sauce, wow. and that's what we want. Yeah. That's and then this is a little bit of leftover pasta, pasta water. water. Okay. Oh, yeah, that'll give us a that's little thickening. Old, old, right? If you go to Italy, when you go to Italy and you watch, you know, the the, the old grandmas cook. The yeah. secret to great pasta sauce is taking some of that starchy water and adding it back into your sauce. Exactly. I'm oh, gonna do it. That yeah. comes with the pan it does, for free. Right. Oh. <laughs> pasta water free. <laughs> Shipping. free. Free. This is so yeah. good. I, 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 um, I do recognize there are a lot of you watching, and, and your mouths are watering, too. We've got some of you on uh, Facebook uh, with us. Hi, Paul. Teddy's watching. He says, now I want ham. Um, <laughs> we've got Barb out there. And um, and we also have a phone call. Lori's calling us from Connecticut. So we're going to say good evening to Lori. Welcome to HSN. Hi, Lori. Hi, Lori. Lori, are you there? Hello? Hi, we've got you. How are you? Good, how are you? I am great now. Are you, um, are you, you know, seeing the Simon Home cast iron for the first time? Let me tell you guys something. I purchased the 12 inch cast iron fry pan back in August. Okay. We have not, we haven't stopped using it since. It's been oh, yes. great. Yes. We're okay. gonna use the fry pan tonight too. I love that you love it because it's a great oh, universal, yeah. isn't it? You can use it for We've everything. We've been cooking steak. Um, we've been doing veggies, pork chops, and Liz. We've been doing the pizza, and I'm 100% Italian. It comes out amazing. Oh it's so gosh. good, isn't it? Lizzie's Pizza Shop. Really? I will be making another <laughs> Who one. Who knew that a nice Irish girl could make such good pizza? I mean, I, it's got to be the pan. You know? It, <laughs> you know, like they used to say, it's got to be the shoes? It's got to be the pan. <laughs> the best ever. Let me tell you guys something. I purchased so many for Christmas gifts, I probably, like, sold them all out for a few weeks. Oh, my God. Well, it's so incredible. It's crazy because at this price, I mean, yes. it makes a, a, a gift that just seems like you're being so extravagant in your gift giving. Oh, for sure. I mean, it, it, it just makes it affordable. They're fantastic. For sure. Lori, how easy is it to clean? Let you guys, this is the easiest thing ever. I swear to you, I take the pizza out, I take the meat out. It's like one little wipe, it's all clean. See, yeah, that's awesome. And yeah. I, like, you know, and that's what some, and Lori, you know what you're doing right too, probably? You're making sure that you're heating that pan right, you're putting the fat in, then you're starting to cook. Because you've watched us cook for all these years. So you always still have to go through those processes mm -hmm. to make sure yeah, that right. things release properly. But the pan really releases great. Yeah. Definitely. I mean, look at this it's pasta. Amazing. I mean, come on. Look at it's that. It's fantastic, and, and I'm 26 years old, and my older brother has been a huge fan of you for years, and he turned me on to you guys, and you guys are just incredible. Yeah. Not only are you so great with, like, cooking and everything you do, but you guys are such humble, passionate people, and it's so nice to see that in today's world, you know? Aww. Thank you. That's we really love what sweet. we do. It thank makes you. it. We, we like our jobs. We're very, very lucky. Lori, thank you so Thanks, much for Lori. your phone call. We're so glad that you love the pans as well. And you um, know what? Thank you, guys. It's such an honor to speak with you. Thank you, Lori. Thank you, Lori. The pleasure is all ours for sure. And if you were listening to Lori and you're saying, you know what? I want to give these a try. Call us, go to hsn.com, pick them up at a holiday price. You're saving $20 off of our HSN price, and you've got free shipping. And think about that for cast iron. It's got, it's got some weight to it, just so you know. Free shipping is a big deal, so don't miss out on that. And you can get it in blue, we've got them in burgundy, or in taupe. So Those I wanna, here's one yeah. more cool trick with the, the double pan. If you don't use the grill lid, like in this I just made the pasta, I didn't use the grill lid, but I could use the grill lid when I go to the table as a trivet also. Right. So it's just yeah. one more great use for the grill, grill lid. And remember, it's, it's retaining its heat. So all of the, you know, all the love you put into cooking, 
um, you want it to be served at the right temperature. And so that, that's a big deal. Um, we are getting questions about Jan, or Jan on um, Facebook asked, we talked about the weight just a moment ago, but um, it does have some weight, but you were saying it's about 10% lighter than your traditional. Than the traditional. Yes. And, it, it, and this pan in particular, because it's, you know, two pieces. Right. Mm -hmm. it, this doesn't feel quite as heavy as some I, either. And, and I, I mean, think too, I think crazy. like... When I grab a pan and it's too light, I know it's only gonna last about six months. Agreed. So this is a weight that it, 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 it's like a good car door. When you close a good car door, you said, that's a good car, you know? Yeah. And it's just a good solid pan. And these pans are made to last a lifetime, not a year. Okay, you know? okay. So. and that's a big deal. So that means when you're cooking, you can rely, you have to rely on your tools. Yeah. Absolutely. And, um, and it really does help the cooking process. So whether you are new to cooking or whether you've been doing it for years, I want you to try these. So um, as we're going through, just know you're getting the, the base and the lid, and you can cook in both pieces. So it's like you're getting two pans in one. These are oven safe up to 500 degrees. You can put them on any stove top, but it's not gonna harm the stove top. And when it's time to clean them, you just wash them. Right. Yeah, yeah. you just wash them. And even, you know, like with this stuffing, you may get a little bit of crust. Mm -hmm. I mean, you and can even see. That's the like, good this is, stuff, uh, though. Right. I mean, it's just pulling away. Yeah. yeah. And really, you know, anytime I've had anything like that little bit of, you know, crust that you might get, five minutes in the sink, soapy water. Yeah wipes right out and you're good to it's go great. there's a reason why you know it's, it's so interesting that there are a lot of things that come and go and there's some things that stand the test of time right this is your it's a modern day version of cast iron right. what we didn't like about cast iron before versus cast um cast iron enamel is that these don't have to be seasoned right no don't have to be seasoned you can wash them with soapy water you don't have to like dry and put them in your oven bake them for 24 like all that crazy right. stuff yeah. you pull them out of the box you wipe them out you start cooking yeah which which is great. Like yeah, that's, right. look at this pork roast that we did. We had this whole that's rack amazing. of pork in the oven with a little bit of fennel and rosemary. And again, see the caramelization on the bottom? Yeah. Yeah. That's the key to happiness. So I'm gonna put a little bit of white wine in there, a little and bit of orange. you can see it orange. bubble around where the brown Ooh. was, and that just. And some flat leaf so parsley and scallions. Right. And we have a pan sauce yeah. that was made right. right in the pan. I'm gonna put a little pad of butter in just because, oh, yeah, hey, what oh, the okay. heck. Butter and, makes everything better. And we take <laughs> this beautiful roast of pork, and again, we have that cast enamel, oh, so the heat was so even yeah. through the whole thing when it cooked. I mean, look at the Perfection. beautiful, juicy pork chops, I and mean, then you just layer them oh right God. back in there. And look, you could plop a couple pieces of fennel on top, Lizzie, oh, and my. we're just gonna go right, again, right could. to the table. This is this is a treat. This looks like luxury. Yeah, I mean, no, it, it looks like you really know what you're doing. So here's <laughs> here's the beauty of doing stuff like this, though. I mean, these pans. When Casanova first came out, Liz and I. This is 25 years ago when we first started dating and living together. We saved for six months to buy one pan because they were several hundred dollars. Right. Wow. You know, now you're getting this pan for almost nothing. You're yeah. in, a, in a restaurant, if you did a pork dish like this in the restaurant, I mean, not in our restaurants because we're very fair, but this is like an $80 dish. Oh my but gosh. you buy a rack of pork like this at the store, 15 bucks, you buy the pan, you save yourself tons of money, right. you impress all your friends. I mean, and that I mean is look impressive at that. Looking. It I mean, is. I know that. You know, Michael just cooked this, yeah, and he does have a little bit of experience. <laughs> but, but, but really, you can make it look this good, and the pan's gorgeous. Okay, yeah. so I know that our clock is quickly running oh. down. Um, this is your opportunity to go ahead and choose the one that's going to come into your home, into your kitchen, and we've got it for you in the tote. We have blue, or we have burgundy, which is the fastest seller this morning. Again, a lot of you are on Facebook with us. Bobby, I'm glad that you're there. Ada, we're glad to see you there as well. Helen Keeney is watching us from home. Uh, hi, Helen. Hi, Helen. We love you as well. Um, Michael is watching us as well. So keep the questions coming. I want to just encourage you, if this is where you want to start, go ahead and do it. 539-483. Now, some of you are saying, I want to be able to cook like that. We do have a cookbook for you. Oh. We do have one. And so we're going to give you the item number for the cookbook. You can see it right here. And this is full color. You've got recipes with 
pretty much everything that you want to eat and cook. It is fantastic. It's all hand signed. It's called Michael Simon's Playing with Fire. And this is a holiday price. You've got two flex on that of $12.48. So if you want to elevate your cooking, you want to do it in a way that just makes it easy for you, then do it for sure. Go ahead and pick up that cookbook. We only have a couple hundred of those remaining. All right. I wanted to share this with you as well because just a moment ago, Michael, I saw that you were grating some cheese yes. on the pasta. Yes. We do have um, a set for you that we want to introduce you to. And it's, um, let me grab my card these on are, that one. These are great. Yeah, we have yeah, the grater, we have a peeler, and we have the, uh, kitchen, shears. the kitchen shears. For sure. Kitchen and all, scissors. Yeah, <laughs> all the same colors yeah. as you as you were able to pick up. Um, okay, and these are um, gonna be your essential tools in the kitchen. Very easy to use in the kitchen. And for someone like me, I have arthritis. You know, so I need things that are very comfortable and work for me. So they have great rubber handles. They're very easy to hold. If you're, a little, very if you're a little stiff in the hands like I am. And they work great. You know, I mean, we use the, the grater for cheeses. We use it for um, oranges, nutmeg, things like that. The peeler, I mean, classic peeler, but just a very good quality one. And, and great shears. I use this for all my gardening um, outside to cut fresh herbs inside. Yeah, and I also, this comes with this protective little shield, yes. which is isn't too bulky, but I always, because I always have this in my drawer, mm -hmm. so you're not reaching in and getting your knuckles getting with it. Knuckles. So it's, it's, and it's nice and easy. It makes it nice and and you Safe can pick in your drawer. Definitely. And you can pick those up. They come as a three-piece set. The peeler, the shears, and the grater. We've got them in blue, burgundy, or gray. And those are a holiday price. Check that out. Our regular price on that was about $22 more. <laughs> so I say that's a great deal, well, and you've got flex pay on those. What a great, you know, hostess gift to bring to somebody sure, or something over the holidays. Sure. And those are the kind of things that we need to upgrade every now and then. Right, absolutely. Sometimes we don't. This is a good time to do that. We're going to take a quick break um, because we've got more to share with you. So I hope keep your questions coming, keep your phone calls coming, and we've got the Simons here for this Ooh. entire hour. <laughs> so definitely stay with us here at HSN. <laughs> Here's your Merry Update for today. Andrew Lessman is here tomorrow, but starting today, you can get free shipping and anniversary pricing on all Andrew Lessman vitamins and supplements. Bundle up the season with Marla Wynn Fashions. Tune in tomorrow to get four flex pay on all Marla Wynn coats and sweaters. And don't miss Michael Simon today with his great kitchen gifts from Simon Home. It's time to get gifty. Find your Merry on HSN and hsn.com. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. HSN this evening and we're glad that you are. We have Simon home for this entire hour and we're in the kitchen. We've got Michael and Liz Simon and we're glad you're here. Call us if you have questions, call if you have a call if you have testimonials or you can join us live on HSN's Facebook page. But we're moving on now to the 12 inch cast iron fry pan. If any of you have have ever used cast iron, it was probably a fry pan. My mom has one, like I mentioned, that she would fry chicken in. Right. Some of the best chicken of I her know. life. Well, that's the thing. It brings <laughs> back it, like great memories of your youth, and yes. you know. And so this, you know, this is a way that you know these these can be generational. These are pans that can definitely be passed down for sure. Um, and you're gonna love them. We've got them in blue. We have burgundy. We have uh, gray and taupe on these. So four colors. Holiday price. $20 off of our regular HSN price, and you even have uh, three flex to get those home. But if you're just joining us, just understand, this is your modern day cast iron because this is enamel. It's not something that you have to baby. Right, exactly. I mean, look, I'm making a pizza in this, my fry pan. Is this the pizza Lori was talking yes, about? Yes, exactly. This I mean, is this a is different one, one than this you made a, last time. Though. I mean, yeah, like, you can do anything you want. I mean, just get your pizza. You can make pizza dough. You can, you know, get it from your local pizzeria. Mm -hmm. um, I just put a little bit of oil on the bottom. It helps with crisping of the crust. Okay. And just whatever ingredients you want. 
Mm -hmm. I mean, I've got, you know, keeping some... it seasonal, though. You have some butternut right. squash yeah. and mushrooms. And this one I'm going to do a little uh, fresh mozz here, too, oh, as wow. well. And literally, if you put this in a 500-degree oven, which this pan can withstand quite mm -hmm. easily, mm -hmm. it, five minutes, and this is going to be done. So we're really? actually cooking this in real time. So wow. I'm gonna pull this out in five minutes and you'll see. I mean, they're just gorgeous. It's a great thing. You wanna get your kids involved and they can, you know, choose the ingredients they wanna put on their pizza. Yeah. It make, it's a fun little family. It is. Dinner treat. In the time it takes for you to have a craving for pizza, you could be eating pizza. Right. I mean, there's no pizza. reason for delivery <laughs> anymore. Well, but no I mean, but that's, that's the amazing thing, though, about because, again, it's such a good heat conductor, 500 degree oven, and it turns into, like, how you get pizza in New York. Right. Like, every, they, they put, pizza ovens in New York, they line their entire oven with uh, bricks to hold that heat and bring the heat up. Yeah. But the cast enamel is doing that same thing. It's bringing all that heat up. So yeah. the pizza, five minutes, it's done. That's true. And, and you know, and you mentioned that, the pizza ovens, but even in the pizza ovens, they have hotter spots and colder spots, right. don't they? Right. This yeah, pan is even. even. No hot yeah. spots. Yeah. Right. No hot right. spots, no cold <laughs> spots. This is exactly. even heat. It's even heat retention as well. So whether it's pizza or maybe you're going for the steak. Well, so yeah, Lori earlier, she said, I got the fry pan. I love making steak in it so we're gonna make a steak in it i got that thing really yeah, hot i apologize really That's not um, so here i'll put a little oil in the cool okay. stuff oh, so okay so we put the steak in there we get that great caramelization mm -hmm. i'm gonna get a little kind of fancy with the steak i'm gonna add some cherries mm -hmm. i'm gonna add again we're doing all the pans some scallions a little bit of bourbon because bourbon and beef are very good friends. Okay. Let's face it, bourbon and anything. <laughs> and then along well. just a little bit of chicken stock. And again, we, we're gonna make this great pan sauce. So all that fond, all that caramelization is gonna come up. Now the other great thing about this pan, when Liz designed it, I think it was so smart. She put, the handle has a split handle, so there's not as much heat coming through the handle as okay. the pan. Okay. And it also has the helper on Thank the other you. side. Thank you. So it's very easy to pick yeah. up if it, again, if it feels the, I mean, a little bit on the heavy this side This one for you. is the 12-inch skillet, so it's a, a, a larger skillet. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I use I usually always use the helper handle. Mm -hmm. Like Michael can pick it up no problem mm -hmm. on his own, but I, you know that's what makes it great. And the poor spouts. Well, both two directional. Right. The, the great thing about the pour spouts is when I do plate this, I'll show you guys when I plate it, I could just pour the sauce right out and the pour spouts on both sides. So whether you're a lefty or a righty, it's easy either way. Well, you exactly. guys have thought of everything. We tried. Right. Yes. We like, tried. I'm sure someone will tell us we did something wrong, but we tried <laughs> to think of everything. There's always that one person, but I'll tell you, everybody else is in love with these. Um, and, and this is that quintessential size. So as you are looking and maybe you just need to add one more pan to your cooking collection. This might be it, it's 12 inches. Um, it's a holiday price, like I said, it's on three flex. We are gonna go to the phones because Diana is calling us from New Jersey. Diana, welcome to HSN. Hi, Diana. Oh, hi, how are you? We uh, are we're great. great. I to hear you say my name. <laughs> <laughs> Diana, um, tell us, what was it about the, the casserole dish that made you wanna get it home? Um. Did I buy the casserole dish? <laughs> I bought the enamel yes. cast iron pan. Yes. Yes. What was it about it that made you want to and get it? The cookbook. Yeah. You know, I don't know a lot about cast iron, and I live literally like 18 miles out of midtown Manhattan, so I'm in the shopping center of the planet. Yes, and you are. And when I go to all the cooking stores, I pick them up, and I'm like, Wow, am I supposed to get this one? Am I supposed to get uh -huh. the one that says you have to oil it and then season it? And then by the time I'm done, I'm like walking out of Bloomingdale's going, I have no clue what I just... Yeah, looked at. Yeah, exactly. And and the cost was probably pretty prohibitive as well. Where this is really, really affordable. Yeah, the cost, the weight, mm -hmm. and I'm not a simpleton when it comes to cooking, but this pan seems to be the one pan that that sends me back to kindergarten. Like I know nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? When you made you a get good choice. Home, you're gonna find that it is an easier way for you to cook because you don't have to 
season it and oil it and baby it. Right. All you have to do is decide what you want to eat and you cook it. It's that simple. Okay. And I'm glad you got the cookbook too. Because well, I mean, you, you know, yeah. the, 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 the secret's always with chefs is we, we get great ingredients and we have great equipment. Mm -hmm. So all we're trying to do is give you the equipment that we would use in our restaurants that we love using at home that makes cooking easier. Yeah. You know, and as we were talking, I pulled the steak out my sauce bit yeah. and I wiped this out with just a wet rag. I mean, yeah. you guys saw I was doing it as we were cooking. And look, it's like, it's ready, it's clean, right, it's ready, ready to go. go. Yeah, that didn't even get a speck of water Didn't even get a speck of nothing. I mean, and then, like, that the is, French toast, too. Yes. This is a custard with um, cornflakes and almonds. Um, oh, yeah, you know, again, like, there's nothing. We're making this table. one just for you, Diana. This yeah. is for you. <laughs> Diana, thank you so there much you for go. your phone call. Kentucky Thanks, County Diana. Definitely. Right. We appreciate you. You'll have your, we're going to send yours right on out. You take care. Um, and so, you know, she's right. Sometimes it can be very confusing. There's a lot out there on the market. Right. Um, but we know, we, you know, we know what we don't want. We don't want something that's going to be um, confusing when we get it home. Right. These are easy. As a matter of fact, we had um, Barbara on Facebook. She asked, does the enamel scratch? It does not. I mean, I won't wreck this knife up, but I mean, you Quit can put anything on this. I know. This, I do it just to annoy you. <laughs> don't, don't we do that? <laughs> I know. But it, it really doesn't. I mean, it's really, really durable. You don't have to worry about it. You don't need to use like a silicone utensil on it and baby it and care for it it's not going to scratch it's going to stay beautiful for, for the life sure. of the pan for sure and and that's a great question too because i think for you know if you if you've cooked with let's say non-stick for so many years we're kind of you know always concerned about what we're about to pick up and right. we know that one false move and that pan is toast yeah right no pun intended. Exactly. Um, but, <laughs> with this, but with this, you don't have to worry about it. No. Um, and again, you're going, you, you can take this to the oven, you can sear it at the highest temperature, and it's no problem. This can actually right. handle it. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, I see. I see some more wine Whoa, coming into play. More wine. Yeah. I'm just having fun with wine. I'm kind of made like this one. We're just winging. I, there was just some fun stuff to cook, so we just started putting in the pan. But we have some pork chops going, and I'm almost making like a like a quick cassoulet, or you know, in in when you in France, it's like when they cook all the pork, the different cuts of pork in this beautiful bean stew. So we just took some cannellini beans, some kidney beans, rosemary, thyme, those seared pork chops, some red wine and stock. I'm gonna Gorgeous. simmer it all together. It's just gonna be fantastic. If you have some bacon at home, some bacon would be really happy in here. Yeah. But again, it's just like a great one pot meal. For sure, and this is your 12 inch. Remember, you've got the handles on both sides, so easy to pick up and transport. These would be beautiful on your table as well. They can go straight from the stove, from the oven, to the table. And you've got the pour spouts on either side. So um, again, they've thought of everything. And if this is the one that you're bringing into your home, choose whether you want it in gray, burgundy, taupe, or in blue, you've got it on FlexPay, and we would love to be able to send it out to you. That looks good. I know. And I saw you cut it with the knife I in did. the pan again. Right in the pan. <laughs> and look, she takes a piece out of me every time she does it. <laughs> Doesn't hurt the pan. Not good for the knife, though. It's <laughs> a good point. Maybe. It's a good point. You know, um, a lot. A lot of you have been asking about the trivets that we have up here. These are cast iron too. They are, so they also conduct some heat mm -hmm. to keep your food a little bit warmer. They've got these wonderful silicone feet, so when you go to put something on it, it's not sliding around, so that's really nice. It's really great. And so again, we've got the same colors. We've got blue, gray, taupe, or burgundy, and those are holiday price. We took about $5 off the price, which is great, and you're getting two of them, and you've got them on FlexPay. So, if you want to go ahead and pick those up, please do so, and we would love uh, to send those right on out to you. No, check us out on hsn.com, because while you're there, um, you're going to see a lot of other great things that we have available for you. And we know that we've got to be prepared in emergencies, and that's where Wise Company comes in. This is the Emergency Mills Preparedness Kit. Uh, comes with 160 servings. So no matter what the emergency is, it doesn't always have to be, um, you know, something really major. It could just be a power outage or something like that, and you need food. Um, and this is the way to always have on the ready for yourself and for your entire family. We've got a price break on that as well, and we also have auto ship available. Okay, so Michael, 
You were talking about the knife. The knife. <laughs> I we, came over by myself because Liz just keeps cutting things in the pan, so she's been banned from knives tonight. <laughs> but, but, okay, but you, so you were saying that, you know, doing that is not good for the knife because the knife is your main tool. Well, yeah, the pans are so hard that they're not good for the blade of the knife, but... Yeah. <clears throat> Cutting on cutting boards is great for the knife. But <laughs> this, you know, we really worked hard on the knives because I, I you know, I've been a, uh, cooking professionally for almost 30 years now. Mm -hmm. And I have a beautiful knife collection. Uh, people always say, Michael, what knives would you buy? What knives do you love? And, and some of my knives, they could go from 500 to 1,000 dollars. You know, and a German steel knife like this, typically at the very cheapest, a German steel knife that has a single tang on it is gonna run minimally 70 up to about 200 $150. So wow. we were able to do this knife for right now, I th what is it, like $15? $14.95. dollars $14 <laughs> Are you kidding me? It's crazy. Every, the box costs more than that. <laughs> so, you know, and this is a knife that has all the things that you look for in a knife. Mm -hmm. It's German steel. It's one single piece of steel. It has a great handle, full tang, incredibly balanced, and it has that great blade that you are looking for in a knife. And German steel's an incredibly hard steel, so it's gonna hold the blade for a good long time. You're gonna have to sharpen it. You have to sharpen any knife. Anytime they tell you you can buy a knife, you never have to sharpen it, they are lying to you. Michael, that makes me nervous. What? You're looking at me, but you're cutting the onion that makes me nervous. <laughs> Don't do that at home. That has nothing to do with the knife. That has, that's 30 that's, years of, of that's, cooking. That's right, that's skill but, right yeah, there. And you know, so you could just go through things with no problem. And really the cool. biggest, what happens when people cut themselves at home, people, my friends, like they're like, I cut myself. And I'll go, or a young cook cuts themselves. I go to their knife, I feel the knife, the knife's not sharp. Mm -hmm. You need a sharp knife and a good knife to make sure that you're going through things easily and then the speed and the skill and stuff like that comes. Okay. But you won't have any of that unless you have a great knife. So you need a knife that feels good in your hand. You know, mm -hmm. when you grab it, and you feel it, it feels comfortable. Yes. You know, it feels balanced, it feels weighted. Yeah. So then the knife is doing all the work for you and you're not pushing through. I'm just barely rocking this through the pepper. Yeah. And it's just slicing it incredibly thin. And that's what you want. This does feel amazing. It's, it's your eight inch chef's knife. Yep. You're choosing your color. We've got them all for you. We've got the gray, we have blue, burgundy, and taupe. And, um, taupe. Yep. We have them, and they come in this beautiful box. Which is great for, like, holiday time gift, right? Yes. Look how pretty that is. Liz designed the box and the colors. Oh, my gosh. I was just that. responsible for the knife itself. <laughs> <laughs> it's teamwork. It is. It's, it's teamwork. Teamwork, teamwork right? makes a dream work. It definitely does. And I, I, I said um, taupe, that's actually white. So it's white, blue, burgundy, or and gray. And the white is my, that's my, mm -hmm. like, mo, my, a lot of my chef knives at home are white handles. So okay. I love white handle and red handle. That's kind of my thing. Oh, nice. Um, Okay. But, you know, and again, I mean, look how it just easily cuts through. Like, I'm barely putting any pressure down. Right. And it's going right through the strip steak like it's butter. So this is going to be the one, the 8-inch chef's knife is going to be the one that you reach for most. There are uh, more specialized knives, but this is going to be the one that you reach for most in your kitchen. And if we're honest, we could all use a new knife, a better knife. Yep. And the fact that these are German steel, full tang, they feel amazing in your hand. Yeah, you have that and it, I mean, at this price, you, at this price, you could buy like five yes. knives. Yes. Because I mean, not, as, as a chef, like you see those big knife blocks. Mm -hmm. They have like seventy-two knives in them, oh. like or, or however many knives are yeah. those giant blocks. Yeah. I've been, I cook for a living. 95% of what I do is a chef knife. <laughs> oh, I use a serrated knife for bread. I might use a paring knife for some small things. Typically I do with a chef knife anyhow. Yeah. But so serrated, a paring, and a chef knife. You only need three knives. You really do. Thank you. So find the chef knife that you love. Yes. Because that is going to be doing 90% of your work in the kitchen always. You know what? I, this one is worth a shot. It's worth a try because I have a knife at home that I thought I loved until I felt this one. It just feels good. I'm going to give hand. you that one. I'm going to give you that one. That's from me to you. Thank you. I appreciate <laughs> Absolutely. that. Absolutely. Go ahead and pick it up. Remember, you've got $10 off. You've got a holiday price. You even have flex pay on this. And um, again, white, blue, burgundy, or gray. It comes beautifully boxed, as you can see right here. So if you want yours, or maybe this is going to be a gift for the, um, the, the cook in your life or the chef in your life, this would be a great time to pick it up. Yep. It's 539441. All right, stay with us. Don't go anywhere. We've got a seven-piece set for your 
cooking pleasure. And it's coming up on the other side of this. Definitely stay with us. <laughs> about shopping at HSN for the holidays? Oh, that one's easy. Flex Pay. Flex Pay is like Santa's little helper. It allows me to get everything on my gift list and make monthly payments with no interest or fees. Even if you're on the naughty list. I got a gaming system for my nephew, a pair of funky boots for my sister, and a little something just for me. Flex Pay allows me to be the best gift giver I can be without the worries of paying for all of my holiday shopping at once. Beat that layaway. How many years have we been making these? Too many to count. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> This is for you. <laughs> you didn't have to do that. I know. I wanted to. Because, <gasps> you know, these never last long. <laughs> You're watching HSN here, and we are in the kitchen. Uh, we've got a full hour with Michael and Liz Simon, and you as well. We're talking amazing cookware, and just in time for the holiday season, at really great prices. So whether you're shopping with us on air, or shopping with us on hsn.com, you're gonna see these amazing holiday prices. And in this case, it's an introductory price for your seven piece set. Now, what you're getting in this enameled cast iron cookware set is you're getting a 10 inch fry pan, which on its own would be $44.95. You're gonna get a one quart saucepan with the lid for your sauces and your gravies. You are getting your three quart round brazier with the lid. That would be $49.95 by itself. The four and a half quart Dutch oven with its own lid, that would be another $69.95. And you're getting four recipe cards included. So all of this is coming today, not for our regular price, not for the retail value, but you've got an introductory price of five flex payments of $25.99. And it's not always gonna be at this introductory price, so I don't want you to wait too long to pick it up. You've got your choice of burgundy, or taupe. Are those the only two we have left? Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. We're going through some pants. I know. <laughs> and burgundy is the most limited, so don't miss out. Okay, there's so I much mean, with this set. Where should we begin? Let's begin with a little bit of croissant bread pudding, Ooh, shall we? Oh, yes. All right, so I've just um, buttered this. Skillet, okay, and the, the ten inch wow. fry pan. It's, it's two forty in the late. morning, honey. Stuff happens, I know. you know. And this is your last show of the visit, right? Exactly. Yeah. It's been a long exactly. visit, yeah. <laughs> so we took cro croissants, put, sliced them in half. <laughs> and I put a little Dijon mustard. It's happening. Should we do a little like Dijon mustard? Sounds, 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 like, sounds like. I'm going to act it out for you. Interpretive dance in a moment. <laughs> and we've got a Mornay sauce, which is a basic cheese sauce. With okay. A few eggs whisked, whisked in. Okay. And I'm just going to layer that on top, and then I'm going to build another layer. Throw this in the oven. Okay. And it's going to be this beautiful breakfast. Oh my gosh. I, I, I love the, the trick about this recipe, too, is go to the bakery and buy the day old croissants because right. they're like Cheaper. half price and they actually make a better bread pudding. Right, really? exactly. Because yeah. you want them to be a little bit dried out. I feel like a better cook just standing next to you listening. I mean, <laughs> it, this is, and you can see that these are things that you can do. Don't be afraid of it. You can, um, you know, uh, prepare and cook your favorite things, but try new things as well. That's Absolutely. what makes cooking fun and right. keeps the boredom out yeah, of it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, and it just shows the versatility of these pans. I mean, yeah. these aren't just for frying. Mm -hmm. You know, I've made cakes in these. Again, we're doing wow. this bread pudding. Yeah. You, know, you can do it. You can get really creative with this. For sure. We, um, oh, so so this is the 10 inch fry pan that you're seeing. We, you can, again, stove top, oven safe up to 500 degrees. We had a question on Facebook Facebook asking, can you use this on a gas stove? Can yeah, here's the, this is the yes. best thing about these pans. Gas stove good, electric stove good, induction fine. Mm -hmm. I bring them outside to my wood-fired grill and put them right on the grates and cook on them out there. They, you know, you could bring them camping. Wow. I mean, they're really, it's the pan that you could do everything on. You don't have to worry, it doesn't do this, you can't put it on that. Da, yeah. da, da, da. All of it's good. Yes. yes. All good. And I'm glad you mentioned that too, because sometimes we don't realize what our pans can't do until we, after we've done it. Right. <laughs> exactly. And then we and have then to throw them away. Late. And right. it's too late. Right. So this is, this really is your everything. Any, yep. any kind of, anything you want to cook, any way 
way you want to cook it, you can do it in the, this set. And that's why you're getting these quintessential pieces. And I love, as you guys are building what we need in the kitchen. We don't, you know, we don't always need 30 pieces of cookware. No, you know, so people, again, we were talking about it with the knife. People overthink this whole thing. You need great pieces of equipment, yep. not a million of them. <laughs> right. You just need the right equipment. That's right. You know, so like a lot of times people come into our kitchen and we cook and entertain almost every day, either for each other or for friends or for almost every day. And they're like, well, I thought you would have more like fancy stuff. I'm like, we got a stove, we got pans, really nice we got knives. We're good. We're good. <laughs> We're good. You know, and and it, it, what it is is it's buying equipment that's so, you know, th this to have a pan that you could go from stovetop to oven up to 500 degrees mm -hmm. to present in the table, it just saves you a lot of headaches. Yes. Well, and these look gorgeous sitting out on your table, presenting your food in them. It, it, it looks very, very pro. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. and, they, and they perform as wonderfully as they are beautiful. Absolutely. So that's great. I'm gonna walk this over to the oven real okay. quick. Okay. Absolutely, and you'll notice that you've got double handles on all of the pots. The, the smaller saucepan does not have a double handle, but because of the size, it's it doesn't little, necessarily right. need it. But you can see you've got lids on all of the pots except for the fry pan, because yep. you don't usually see a lid on a fry pan anyway. No, and the fry pan's great because you can kind of do everything. You can make, brec I always say it's my breakfast, lunch, dinner pan. You can make great. eggs with it in the morning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You could make a, you know, a, a, a patty melt with it at lunch, and you could cook a steak in it at dinner. So you really could do a lot with it. I'm glad you mentioned that. Someone um, on, let's see if I can find it, on Facebook, oh. Here it is. Michael says, does it make good grilled cheese? Heck <laughs> yes. Sure because does. it's the, the even heat again. You know, it's that even, to make a good grilled cheese, you need heat to be even all the way across the pan. So one half of your cheese isn't burnt and the other half is the bread's still white. Not all the cheese is melted. Yeah, you need that even exactly. heat. That's yeah. really what does the big, you know, the big deal. For sure. I'm over here just making chili. I, I'm kind of well, losing yeah, my focus. I know. That's, yeah, that's I, you know, well, right now, Liz, great. it is, it is Friday. The... It is Saturday morning. Yes. And the Browns are playing on Sunday, and I'm getting some chili going because we're rolling right now. For sure. The only, when you're from Cleveland and your team's 500 five games into the season, this is like a Super Bowl for us. So I'm making chili. <laughs> I don't even know I what that means. She has no idea. No, 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 I'm with you. I'm a football fan. Right? A football fan. I love it. And, and you know what? Um, this just goes to show. You cook what you want to cook. And this is the, uh, the four and a half quart Dutch oven. Right. And I, you know, I made it. This is a great It's such a good size, size because yeah. I put a lot of stuff in here. It's halfway full. Mm -hmm. This is enough chili for four, mm -hmm. you know. But if I wanted to amp it up, it could be enough chili for 10 or 12, no problem. Yeah. So you could do... A, you know, a small family or a group of people, which is right. what you're looking for in a Dutch oven. That's right. Yeah, I mean, for the, yeah, I would say, like, you know, a good hearty dish for six in, yeah. the, in this yeah. one for chili yeah. purposes. And again, you put the lid on. This is a great stovetop dish. You let it simmer away. Mm -hmm. And the lids on all the pans, you know, they have the dimples on them. Okay. And what the dimple does is it keeps the moisture in it and it almost self-brazes. So when I drop the lid down on this, I don't have to really worry that Everything's gonna evaporate out, including the flavors and dry things out. I'm gonna put it down to a lower heat. The, the moisture is gonna go back down into the chili. It's gonna keep everything from sticking on the bottom of the pan, so it puts us in a really nice place. It's a great, yeah. I've never, I've never just, seen that. Yeah, yeah. They, they really yeah. help. They really make things easier. It's usually on very expensive pans. Yes, right. yes definitely. You know, so it just shows that we you know, put a lot of thought into the quality. Yeah, we, you know, know like, well like again, we were talking about earlier, pans like this used to cost a lot of money, and we wanted to make sure that we could make them affordable, but everything that you saw in the really expensive ones, we didn't want to leave those out of these. So yeah, when right. you're cooking in them at home, we want you to have kind of the high-end experience at a very affordable price. Absolutely, and you, so you've got everything that you love about cast iron and none of the things that you don't. Because remember, and if you're just joining us and didn't hear us earlier, you don't need to season these. You don't need to oil these and, and bake them and cure them or anything like that. You get them out of the box, give a little wipe out, and you start cooking. And then when it's time to clean them, you wash them. It's very simple. There's nothing you exactly. can't, there's, there are no utensils that you can't use on these. Now you wouldn't wanna, you know, use your 
eight inch chef, chef's knife. Right. <laughs> as, as we all saw, as I got as banned. She, but she's going to keep the, doing it, so we're right. just, yeah. I just know what's going to happen. Yeah. So the pants can take the beating. Yes. The knife cannot, the pants can. <laughs> can take right. it. Right. So they don't, it's not going to scratch, it's not going to ruin ooh. it. You put, ooh, are you making cider? I'm mold doing cider? a little mold cider. <gasps> <laughs> Excuse me. How to go feel? along with your chili. So when my friends come over mm -hmm. <laughs> to watch football, <laughs> we like to do a little mold football? cider. No. Okay. No. no, I drink the mold she, cider. She with thinks bourbon. Baker Mayfield is the pitcher, for, a pitcher for the Indians. <gasps> no, he's a boxer. He's a boxer. He's a boxer. <laughs> <laughs> No. That is All the right. best. Damn it. 25 close. years of happiness. Close. It doesn't matter. You so don't close. have to all like the same things. We are living so proof of that. Close. This is okay. So nice. Cinnamon sticks, what else? Yeah. <laughs> and oh, and you're using the peeler oh. from I our, am, uh, yeah, because earlier. to garnish our cocktail. Okay. With, and that's another great thing. I mean, yes. to have in your bar cart mm -hmm. or, you know, Definitely. buy your bourbon. Definitely. <laughs> you want to keep. But you know, for any for any kind of citrus, it's great to Definitely. have this because it's it's not going in too far to the pith. So great. So I'm just gonna. So you see how these. it all works together. You see that. You see how this all works together. And so, remember, you're getting the bra the three-quart brazier. Is that what this one is? The three-quart three brazier? Three-quart brazier, yes. yes. This one does come with the lid. We're not showing you that right here. But but you also have the Dutch oven with the lid. You have the fry pan, and you have the saucepan with the lid. Seven pieces. You're also going to get your four recipe cards. If you love this burgundy, you are not alone because so many of you are picking it up. It is the most popular. And we also have it for you in taupe. Those are the only two colors that we have, but they're good ones. Um, we're they gonna are. go to the phones. Sharon is calling us from Arizona. Sharon, welcome Hi, to Sharon. HSN. Hi, Sharon. Hi. I just want to let you know I have the burgundy set. Yes. <laughs> nice. I nice. love that set. I cook on it every day. Oh, Thank you, that's Sharon. That's fantastic. Is it as easy yeah. as we say? Is it as easy as we show? Yes, I'm looking at the show right now. Yeah. And I'm saying, yeah, no, wow, it's, that's my set. Yeah. <laughs> I just made some rice yesterday. It turned out so fluffy. I couldn't, in that little pot. Well, that, and I love it. With that lid too with your rice. And cornbread in that big pan mm -hmm. and stuck it in the oven. Perfect. Sharon, I'll tell you what, I, I just finished it. some chili. You come over here with your cornbread, yes. and we got a party, it's baby. Party. We got a party. Oh, no. I'm still looking. I saw you just wave your hand. I see you cooking over there. Oh, I see always you. cooking. Always I cooking. I love it. I'm still looking at it. It's almost a quarter to 12 midnight. I'm still looking. Oh, my God. I love it. Sharon, I am so glad you called. Wanna thank you. Thank your wife, because that's a good idea. That style of it is very good. It's heavy. I picked that whole thing up from outside myself wow. Wow. I, I said might be somebody uh, um, coming along and might see it that big box out there that's right. right and I picked it up and bought it in yeah wow it's nice and sturdy I yes. love that set and I love that burgundy I love I do anyway. too thank Sharon, you thank you Thank you so Perfect. much for your phone Thank call. You. Thank you. We appreciate you. I so love much. Sharon. I, I do too. You. I see you smiling. <laughs> <laughs> you take care. And you know what? It, I love to hear the excitement in her voice. Yeah. Because when you get something that works as it's supposed to, and it makes your life in the kitchen that much easier. Right. Well, and exactly. you know what, too? It's like we, listen, I, like how we are in the kitchen right now is kind of how we always are in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. We're in the kitchen together a lot. We have fun, we laugh, we bust each other's chops a little bit, and we entertain a lot. So we want it to be fun and easy. You don't want to struggle through this part of it. It should be enjoyable. Yes. Right. Cooking should be enjoyable. Yeah, it Absolutely. should be. And if, and if you can't say that right now because of the tools that you're using, they're not really working right, then try something new. We have to eat every day. Heck right? yeah. There's not a single day in the world that we don't have to eat. So we may as well um, have the tools that make it easy for us. And I believe that when you, you know, can cook and prepare a meal for your family and bring everybody to the table, it just makes a difference. Exactly. It's yeah. just special. It's, it's a nice time. For sure. Yeah. So, so you're looking at the seven piece set right there in burgundy. We also have it. That's what Sharon has, who just called in. We also have it for you in taupe. And um, this is going to be your time to get it on an introductory price. It's not always going to be this price. Um, it will eventually be the HSN price. So save the extra $30. Save your shipping because it's free shipping on this set. And um, get it home. Try it out. Get comfortable with it. So when you're, if you're doing Thanksgiving this year, let me ask you this. 
Would you be embarrassed for your family and friends to see what you're cooking on right now? Because you know everybody hangs out with the kitchen. <laughs> right. They're going to see so the whole true. pot. You yep. know? They, they right. hang out in the kitchen and they go through your medicine cabinet. Yes. So yep. you better be proud of those two things. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> right. Prepared. You know they're going right. to. They're looking. <laughs> right. But these, it makes it easy for you to cook. And you take them straight from the stovetop or the oven straight to the table and serve right from there. And all of that heat retention means the food is going to stay hot and stay um, delectable, really. Yep, it keeps it warm. But, and look, here's a couple things that we did when, when we were chatting away. We finished it, I had a, a finished chili. I just garnished it with a little bit of uh, yogurt and a little bit of cilantro. Lizzie made the malt cider. I have a big pot roast going. And look at how this, I caramelized this on all the sides. It got all really golden brown and yummy. And we're gonna add the onions, the carrots, the thyme, and I'm just gonna braise this all together, which is great. Oh. And this was from, this isn't, we're not selling this right now, but it came out, Liz's pizza came out so good. Ooh. I just wanna put it out there for everybody to see. I know, I forgot <laughs> the to put pizza. my pizza out. Yeah, somebody on Facebook was asking, <laughs> what happened to the pizza? There, yeah, it, there, is. there it is. There it is. We're gonna be eating that in about, 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> That's dinner. That's dinner for sure. Um, so keep keep your questions coming in. Kenzie on Facebook asked, how do you keep the set from rusting? Oh, well then. It's, it's not gonna rust because of that enamel coating. That's the beauty of this is the, you're, you're not rusting. Mm -hmm. It's never gonna rust. I mean, you can put it in your sink with soapy water. You can leave it overnight if you want to. It's Nothing's gonna happen to it. Again, you do not have to baby this even a little bit. Yeah, a, a lot of times, and you could never do this with cast iron, a lot of times we'll have a lot of people over for a party and you know, we have some soothing but potent beverages and <laughs> you kind of forget about some of the I dishes, like so to speak. So like, you know, you finish dinner, you put the pots in the sink, you kind of fill the sink up with some soapy water and sometimes you, you, you want to clean everything before you go to get bed, but sometimes yeah. you leave some things in the sink. Right. Yeah. They're sitting in soapy water all night. Mm. You, you wipe them out the next day, they're perfect. Yes. You know, so in a cast never iron pan rust. it would get rusty, it would be a mess. You don't have to worry about with right. that with these. And that's a big deal. That's why we say it's your modern day of cast iron. It is, you know, we started off saying it's not your grandmother's cast iron. You know, she cooked a lot of great meals in that. But this just makes it easier for you um, today and for the future, because you're gonna, I don't see you having to rebuy these any time no, soon. No, this is the same thing. Just like cast iron pans that got passed from our grandparents to our parents to us, this is, gonna, this is the same kind of pan. All it's doing is it's making your life a little bit easier. Mm -hmm. All the things that you love about cast iron, the way that it cooks, the way that it looks, the history, the store, mm -hmm. you get all that with these pans, except they're just a little bit easier to use, easier to clean, 10% lighter, mm -hmm. so there's, you get the, the happiness and benefits. For sure, for sure. And, and beauty. And beauty as well. <laughs> and you can get these home. I know that our clock is quickly running down. Can I t have a taste of that? Of that cider? Yes. Oh yes. I just it just looked too good. Absolutely. Good. I, could, I know. We haven't fed you. We're gonna have to I know. feed you. We haven't oh fed you a gosh, thing. Oh my gosh, that's so good. It's so oh warm gosh. and cozy. Isn't oh. it just holiday? Oh time. my gosh, that is amazing. Let me ask you. Um, we had, um, I think it was Nancy wrote in asking, is there a recipe for the bread pudding that you mentioned? Um, in the, is it, is there one there in the is, book, yes. in the cookbook? There's, this one's not in the cookbook. Not in the cookbook. Okay. Um, but you know what, I'll, you I, I, it, it might be on page. HSN's page. If not, I'll put it on my own Facebook page tonight. Thank you. It's super easy. It's yeah, a basic it's really bechamel, easy. so butter, flour, cream, uh, and cheese, or Mornay yeah. with the eggs, and I'll put the recipe up on my on my Facebook page. And quite you frankly, know. this is something you can make the night before and put it in your refrigerator, yeah. so in the morning you can just... These bake great it. Ideas. Yeah. These are great ideas. Like I said, I, I feel like I'm becoming a better cook. You know, just by <laughs> listening, just by knowing and having the right tools. One thing I also love about these, and it's a small thing, but it's a big thing. It's that top handle, that it's high enough so that let's say I'm not using, I don't have a, a you know, a, right. a, a, ra a rag in right. my hand. My hand is not so close to the lid. Right, exactly. Right. I mean, it will conduct the heat mm -hmm. eventually. I mean, this is sitting on an on, on a very hot burner. On a hot burner. Oh, oh I gotta make. Wait, lonesome. you just told me I forgot to make cranberry <laughs> sauce. So this again, my holidays are around the corner. You put in the cranberries. Okay. You put, and look at how hot you could see the steam coming out there. Now, cold orange juice. Watch how quick it comes. It's immediately at a simmer because of the way that right. that pan is conducting heat. Okay. Some scallions. Oh, scallions. Okay. Just because I like to say scallions. <laughs> Some oranges. Get that Midwestern. Yeah. And then a touch of honey. Oh. 
And I'm just gonna put a pinch of salt in here and in <gasps> two minutes we have cranberry sauce. That's so great. No more canned cranberry no, sauce. Not that one like when you open it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that no. crazy weird sound, that weird sound. Yeah. You can make it in a couple minutes at your house, no problem. Your Give your guests fresh cranberry sauce. They will be so happy that you didn't put the cranberry loaf <laughs> on the I middle of the table. Though. Mom, I'm sorry. <laughs> nope. I'm sick of the loaf. Yeah. This is I, so much easier. I really like canned cranberry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can't help myself. <laughs> I just really like it. Stay on the phone for this 70 <laughs> set in Burgundy. Everybody's laughing. Everybody from the culinary group is like, really? <laughs> I know. Um, seven piece set in burgundy or in gray, um, or in taupe, excuse me. The tongs, we have time to see the tongs, and we've got a two piece tong set, a nine inch and a 12 inch. I'm these are great, right yeah. I mean, these are wonderful, again, save, um, space savers mm -hmm. in your kitchen, because when you tip them upside down, they open, mm -hmm. and then you just ah! tip them up, and they're, you know. So they're not all flying around in your drawer and things are getting stuck on them. So these are really super handy. So Ooh. perfect. Love it. And so you're getting two of them. You're getting the nine inch and you get the 12 inch and you can choose your color there as well. Um, so in burgundy, blue, or in taupe. And also the 12 inch fry pan that we did the pizza in. The all day pan. The all day pan. That the all day pan. That is enormously